Hey, good morning. I hope you're having a great day. And today, Psalm chapter 8, sermon is posted if you want to catch that. Today, verses 1 and 2, what we're going to talk about is uh, just the majestic Lord that we have. And so check, check this out. The, the text reads like this. O oh Lord, our Lord, how majestic is your name in all the earth. You've set your glory above the heavens. Out of the mouths of babes and infants, you've established your strength because of your foes to steal the enemy and the avenger. And so today, um, just, just get this. O oh Lord, our Lord, how majestic is your name in all the earth. Our God is just such an amazing, magnificent, wonderful God. And the, the psalmist, he uses two words for Lord. He uses the first one's God's personal name. It should be all caps in your Bible. The second one is a, a word that means king or ruler or like majesty. And so what he's doing is he's saying our our God, and he's making it personal, not, not just mine, but ours as believers. We have this God. Is it so such an amazing God. And this God, his glory is even above the heavens. And so what he's doing is he's saying, man, the, the creation is amazing. God's better. And today, what I want you to think about as you go about your days is think about how much better God is in the creation. And the question I have for you is, in your life, how does it make you feel to know God and to know that his majesty is even better than the things that we see in our world?